How's it going guys? Uh, Mike here. What I want to do in this video is, as, as the title says, uh, I, want to, I want to set some expectations for you guys. I want to be real with people uh, because uh, over the last probably week or so, I've, I've received uh, a larger number of uh, messages than, than usual and there have been two clear kind of thoughts from people uh, and, and I'm going to talk about all this. The, the thought is you're at tier 20,000. Why are you not making a million dollars a year, right? We've seen other YouTubers do this. Uh, you know, everybody's making uh, $5,000 in profits. Uh, I just, I just don't understand what's going on with your account. Tell us uh, what not to do. Tell us uh, what you feel like you've done wrong over the last couple of years. And then there are people, other people who have been messaging me and, and basically saying, what are these people talking about? Like we've been in this uh, game for a few years. Uh, this channel is probably the, the most real as, as it can get. So I actually wanted to spend a few minutes and, and tell you guys, go through this. I'm going to go through all of this. And I'm going to tell you exactly what happened and what to, to kind of view merch uh, by Amazon as. So number one, I, I want to tell you that this is going to be kind of like tough love, but love. And, and there's, I've been trying to set the, the theme for, for this whole channel as, as positive. What we're doing here is we're doing this together. We're, we're going through this. And if there's anything that you guys learn, uh, leave it in the comments, not just for me, but for everybody else. And if there's anything that I try, for example, a new automation tool, uh, running ads, doing whatever, right? I'm going to share that with you guys. And that, and that is the whole point of, of this whole project that I'm doing here. The, the one thing that I'm going to say is I don't want anyone again to take anything that I'm saying as kind of like uh, bashing other people or anything. I just want you to listen to the words that I'm saying, because what I'm trying to do is help you out. If you see someone on YouTube, for, for example, for a while, talk about how great Merch by Amazon is and, and basically just tells you that it's like this new amazing thing that you that will change your life and everything. That's exactly what I thought right here, right? All of this time in, in 2017, when I got approved for uh, Merch by Amazon, I honestly like I was in the mindset and, and only because I was watching YouTube videos daily of people, you know, uh, putting out uh, sales updates, what they're doing, how they're doing, everything's great, everything's wonderful. I honestly thought that within a year, uh, I was going to be able to quit my job, I'm going to be working, uh, you know, Amazon's going to be paying my bills, uh, I'm going to open up a few other stores, not just on Etsy, eBay, online store, like all that kind of stuff. And things are going to things are going to happen because that's what the YouTube world shows you. And then at some point, I actually realized, and this is something that you guys can can think about, the people that I'm watching, not, again, nothing wrong with anything that, that's happening out there, but they're actually making more money off of you watching those YouTube videos and selling their programs and all that kind of stuff than the money that they're making from, from merch, right? So keep that in mind. If you go into this with a mindset that it's anything other than a business, like any other business that you would uh, run, then you're going to do it wrong. Okay. So let's, let's, let's take it through this because what you have to realize is that people who are, um, at, at tier 500, for example, I, I think I was sharing this story a while ago. Uh, there was a guy tier 500 sold something like 15,000 shirts, right? If you think that that's going to happen naturally, organically, by you just simply posting and listing products, that's where you're going to be disappointed. And that's the whole purpose of my channel is to show you that if you're just a random dude or a girl uh, who's starting fresh with not a lot of not only business experience, but graphic design experience, advertising experience, uh, you know, experience in any kind of a business, 
these are the typical results. If you think that just simply because, uh, you know, uh, Amazon now gave you a, a Merch by Amazon account that you're going to get free money because you saw some guy or girl on YouTube uh, making $10,000 a month, that is where the disappointment will come in. That's where those questions come in, where people are saying, well, you're at this tier and you're not making this much money. Like, like for example, it doesn't make sense. Forget about the numbers. Think about uh, what your skill level is, what your designs are like, and then go based on that, right? Don't just think that, that you're at a certain tier level and uh, you know things are just gonna happen for you magically. It doesn't happen like that, right? There's a lot more involved. If you see any of these videos uh, where people are saying, hey, I made $10,000 this month, trust me, they, they know exactly what they're doing. They're not working alone. They've spent a lot of time, um, you know, doing uh, developing marketing strategies, uh, looking at the designs, looking at the niches. It's a full time job. It is a business. Don't think uh, of of it as anything else. Right. Let's go. Let's go through this because I want to show you guys. So March 2017, I get um, approved. I get approved and, and I'm thinking, oh, my God. This YouTuber told me that my life is going to change, right? So as you can see here, uh, stuck in tier 10, right? Uh, designs are terrible. I, I have no design background. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm promoting these, uh, you know, 10 t-shirts that I have. I'm, I'm pinning them on Pinterest, uh, putting them on Facebook, all that kind of stuff. None of that matters, right? These were organic sales. And uh, I was saying, if anyone's asked me, you know, over the last couple of years, what was my biggest kind of regret with merch? It was not buying myself out of tier 10. And, uh, and look at this. One, two, three, four, four months of, of doing something like this, just waiting to get tiered up. And I can't remember if it was like tier 25 or 50. Uh, and then, you know, I got tiered up and I was like, okay, this is a game changer, right? Uh, this is this is my sales are going to explode. That's what the guy on YouTube said. And and then again, 10, you know, 50. So, so things start to pick up and I'm like, oh, my God, like it, it actually might happen. Uh, but what I didn't recognize is that this was Q4, right? A lot of these sales were coming in. So I peaked in November of 2017, 200 sales. As you can see here, royalties of eight hundred and forty four dollars. And, and I honestly thought like there's, there's no going back. Like this is, this is what happens with merch. Once you get to a certain, and I think I was at a tier like 500 here. So I can't remember. And, and I was like, nothing like, you know, these guys on YouTube are saying that your sales are going to explode. Like they're making a hundred thousand dollars in profits a year. How is that not happening to me? So anyways, but keep in mind that every single day here, I'm working on new designs, I'm, a, I'm listing things, I'm changing things, right? All that kind of stuff. So it's not like I ever got lazy. And then of course the new year starts. So we're in 2018. So again, I can't remember which tier, like just I think, think of it as maybe tier uh, 500 or a thousand at some point here. So we go through 2018, as you can see here, it's hovering, it's hovering around 100 and 130. You know, I'm not seeing that, that growth that I was promised on YouTube. Like I'm, I'm not, you know, every month is not doubling. So, so what's going on, right? Again, keep in mind that I'm a guy working a full-time job at the time. I was uh, about to get married, all that kind of stuff, bought a house. Like I, I'm actually living my life, working a full-time job and then doing this pretty much any minute, any spare minute that I had, right? So at no point was I getting lazy, right? And, and I was exploring, you know, new apps. Uh, I think there was a, at some point, at one point there was a Merch Buddy or something like that, because for example, a Merch by Amazon didn't have the ability to save your uh, information so that you could just kind of copy uh, uh, the info in there for a bunch of products. You have to enter everything manually. Uh, I was, I was kind of just learning about, you know, new niches and all that kind of stuff. But again, I was generating a hundred dollars, a hundred sales a month consistently. But again, keep in mind, now we're talking a year and a half later, and I'm still, you know, not making a $10,000 a month that I was promised. And then my, my sales started increasing. So this is a Q4 of 2018. Again, 
recognize that it's Q4. So a lot of these sales are organic. And at this point, I think it was September, October, uh, for the first time ever, this is when they introduced pop sockets. One of my products gets uh, tagged as Amazon's choice. And it was for a pretty nice term. I can't remember what it was, something like purple pop socket, right? Even though there was a design, but it was like a very commonly uh, searched term. And my sales just exploded. This is where I got super excited. December of 2018, my sales peaked, sold 580 products, right? Awesome. All of a sudden, in January or February, the tag is removed. It starts hovering around just because of the bestseller rank and all that kind of stuff for about a month or two. And then sales just start going down because that one product was generating most of my sales. I think it was like one month, it was like something like 250 to 300 sales uh, for that one product. Uh, and then again, I went back to that norm and I was thinking, you know, what happened here? You know, I'm already here probably at tier uh, two or 4,000. I can't remember, probably not 4,000. And, uh, but again, you know, I was promised. I, I thought I was gonna quit my job. What happened? Uh, my sales are not going through the roof. And again, go back to the, the actual situation. What's going on? I am not working on this as a, a, you know, eight hours a day as a full-time job. I don't have staff who are doing, you know, a niche research. I don't have people running ads. I'm, I'm not anymore, you know, listing, uh, pinning every single product because now we're talking about thousands of products. So a lot of this is organic sales and you're doing what you need to do, right? You're listing because this is a long-term game. Do not get tricked into thinking that this is going to change your life in a year. It will if you have experience, if you know what you're doing, right? Keep in mind that, for example, a clothing company would not hire you uh, to run their, uh, you know, uh, business if you didn't have that experience. So if you think that you're getting into this with, with zero experience, but you're going to have the results that somebody has who's been in the game for 20 years, that's where that disconnect is. So, so for example, the, the, you know, oh, this guy's at tier 20,000, uh, he should be making, you know, $50,000 in profits every year. Is, is not the right way to look at this. You have to look at the, the actual situation and, and see what kind of work you're putting into this. Uh, so most of my stuff right now, and so here's the other thing that, let's actually go through this because I don't wanna get uh, off on a tangent. So we get into you know uh, the end of 2019, and again, sales plateau, and they actually start dipping. Like it's Q4, what's going on, right? Uh, then we get into 2020 and there's discussion that COVID hits at the beginning. Like some, some people are just talking about it. Uh, sales start dipping and all of a sudden, Amazon starts taking off every single product because they can't keep up with the demand because of COVID. There's a huge outbreak there. There are lockdowns happening and then sales just dip April zero and then it never went back. So, so now that we're looking at the last year, right? So now we're May, 2020. Again, this is nothing. This is just the recovery from COVID. We're hovering around a uh, hundred sales a month. This is where I'm at tier 8,000. And, uh, and again, still doing my thing, right? Still listing products, uh, going with the, you know, evergreens and all that kind of stuff. And then this is where things changed for me, for my account. In October of 2020, November 2020, so, so about May, I started listing political, politically themed products because I, was, uh, I, I knew that the election was going to be a big deal. It's happening in November, and, and that's just kind of like the niche that I wanted to push. So for, for about six months, you know, random sales for those products. And then all of a sudden, on, just I think it was on election night or the day before, one of my products spikes. And I started selling maybe 50, 60 a day. And uh, so this was the big spike, right? Still at eight, uh, tier 8,000. And then four days later, four days later, just my luck, uh, they introduced a policy about uh, no profanity directed at one person or organization or something like that directly. And mine was exactly that. It was kind of like F this person. Not, not exactly, but the design was 
kind of uh, something like that, right? And then my sales drop right away. And then, so keep in mind, look at, look at my total number of sales, 8,110. So at, at this point, like right now, we're in June of 2021. This is when I should have been tiered up to 10,000. But I was listing, this is when they introduced all the marketplaces. I think Japan was one of them. And I, and I started listing products to all these different marketplaces, including Japan. All of a sudden, I get it. I, I log into my account. I see that I've been tiered up. I've skipped a tier. I went, went from 8,000 to 20,000. And I can't remember when. It was just a couple of months ago. I think it was in, in February. And, uh, and that's when everything changed because of the volume. So, so I started listing. And then again, because of the number of designs that I had up, my sales go up. And as you can see here, to 259. And now last month, 193, 197, and here we are in June with, with this change and, and the, these types of products, like this, this number of products, 32,000. Again, I've, I've done the math for some of you guys, but I'm gonna do it again just because uh, if anyone new here is watching, look at this, if I was at a, a tier 20,000, so now I'm listing uh, one design to every single product. So, so let's look at this, 12,566 divided by 64, the reason divided by 64 is because that's every single product, every single marketplace is pretty much what I'm doing is just under 200 designs. So now we, we have to realize that we're looking at different kinds of numbers. I'm no longer listing thousands of designs, but now in the last month or so, I've listed 200 designs to 12,000 products, right? So this is where we are. We've, we've gone from tier 8,000 to 20,000 in a few months. And we've seen that big increase uh, with, with the possible uh, number of products that you can have up. So right now I'm, I'm, I'm around uh, 3,400 products. I know somebody asked me a couple of days ago. So out of the 20,000, I actually have only 3,000 products uh, live and at the total, sorry, designs live. And, and the total number of products, as you can see here, is 32,000, which brings me to the, the conclusion, to the end. Merch by Amazon is amazing. Keep in mind what this program is. This is a partnership with uh, one of the biggest companies in the world where they're saying, you bring us the designs, you put up the listings, we're going to uh, make we're gonna print, we're gonna pack, we're gonna ship, we're gonna deal with customer service and you're gonna collect royalties. This is that kind of a program. This is amazing, right? But do not have any grand, any false expectations because you're gonna end up getting hurt. Just because you've been approved for Merch by Amazon, just because you got tiered up to 1,000, to 8,000, to 20,000, doesn't mean that you're going to be making a million dollars a year because that's not your skill set, right? Like I said, everybody on YouTube. So, so look around. When's the last time that you actually saw somebody say, I, I've had a, a terrible day, terrible week. I, I can't, I can't even, you know, figure out why or something like that. What you see are these amazing uh, results. Again, th they're real, right? They're real, but don't ever forget that there's a, large amount of advertising put in. There's a large amount of money spent on uh, other people possibly doing the research for those people. It's it, they're running a business, right? So if you're not investing that kind of time and money into it, and especially, for example, uh, if you're selling a, a, a program or some kind of training or, or something on YouTube, your whole business is reliant on you getting these amazing results. So again, I'm not saying that these people are not real. I'm just saying that this channel here is exactly why I, why I did it because it, it's an everyday guy, right? Doing this with you. Uh, you know, if I ever get to a point where I can actually put out some kind of training because of the success that I've had uh, with this program, I would love to do that. But right now there, there is none of that. These are, 
your you know daily sales updates for somebody who's in tier 20 and i just told you how i got there i'm, I'm still should be in tier 8000 and getting tiered up to 10000 and and i never want anyone especially new people to to be lied to to be tricked or 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 given the impression that this is you know what you got approved for merch by amazon now you're now you're in the bank right you're going to be making a lot of money um, i bet you any money that anyone watching this who actually has been around the channel and, and been with me for a while and is in tier 8,000, uh, 10,000, 20,000, uh, if they were willing to share their actual experiences in the comments below uh, to, to let new people know how you know, hard it could be, how easy it could be, how you can have a, a zero month, not because of anything that you've done, because you've busted your butt, you know, uh, for the last couple of years, but because of uh, you know Amazon's choice to to not show any listings, uh, every for the last couple of years, people newer to to the uh, uh, merch by Amazon don't know that every uh, Q4 Mer Amazon's throttling uh, listings, so you can't even list products as as much as you used to. You don't see your products. So there's a lot going uh, there's a lot going on that's out of your control. So basically the whole message here is set your expectations uh, to, a, to a realistic level. Uh, when you see somebody online, uh, just realize that that's a business for them, that, that they're also making money from, like I said, you watching those videos and they're probably making more money. Uh, I remember when I was getting into trading, uh, you know, the, the big sales pitch was, hey, start an account with $500 in six months, you're going to make 100000 right? And it's, everybody who sees that, it's kind of like, why wouldn't I do this, right? But it's not the real expectations. It's a, it, it, expectation, it's a sales pitch. So, so that's, that's how I'm coming to you guys um, with, with this. And, and I'm going to do another one. I like these Merch Buzz series because I, I, it's a longer format. I actually get to talk about a lot. I'm going to go through your questions and your comments because hard questions on this channel are actually welcome. Unless you're insulting me directly or someone else, like one of the other viewers through comments, I actually have no problems with any kinds of questions and that's the whole point of this. Let's help each other out, right? My total sales, you can see here, 138244 for total royalties of about $25,000, right? Now, again, look look how long that took, right? Somebody's gonna tell you that you're gonna make $100,000 in a year. I really hope you will, but it's, it's gonna happen only when you know what's happening, you're gonna have other expenses, you're gonna have people that are working with you, uh, that are working for you, who are running your ads, uh, who's doing research, you're gonna be familiar with a lot of automation tools. Like for example, I just got signed up to uh, Merch Titans a couple of months ago, right? I could there's no way that I could be listing this many products the, the old way So there's a lot to learn and there's a lot to to do. There's a lot of possibility here uh, I just want to again once again remind everybody that this Even though sometimes the tone of this video could be interpreted as kind of negative It's not keep in mind that I'm here every single day and and doing things every single day and sharing this kind of stuff with you which means that I'm extremely optimistic that I'm extremely happy about uh, merch in general and again you know I'm not just on merch it's all of print on demand and and but I again I want to share I want to be real with you guys and, and that's that's I think it's rare sometimes especially on YouTube because there's no a uh, point there's no benefit to people talking about you know uh, a, a day where they had three sales there, there is no benefit because how will you you know sign up to their training course why would you invest money in any of the other services that they're providing right so anyways I'm gonna wrap it up here uh, keep in mind that that you know uh, without work uh, nothing's gonna happen if I had given up uh, you know uh, here let me let me give this a second you know back here when the sales started dipping Right now, I wouldn't be making a thousand bucks a month, right? Uh, so that, that's the way I look at it. You know, five years from now, maybe I'm gonna be making 
5,000 bucks a month. I don't know, but I'm definitely not going to stop. Merch is, is a once in a lifetime opportunity. Uh, you know, don't, don't get lazy, but again, don't uh, think that you're going to be quitting your job uh, next year just because somebody uh, told you on YouTube that, that, you know, sales only go up, that they never go down and that things uh, will just happen magically. Anyways, I'm going to wrap it up here. Thanks, guys. Hit that like and subscribe. Uh, if you have any questions, any real questions, hard questions, don't hesitate to, to leave them down below. And I'll, uh, I'll talk to you guys soon.